Hello and welcome to 1000 Swahili words. In Swahili we say maneno elf moja ya Kiswahili. Last time somebody asked me what is the difference between Swahili and Kiswahili. Swahili is used when you speak English. Kiswahili is the translation of Swahili in Swahili. Anyway, when you speak Swahili, you have to say Kiswahili. When you speak English, you say Swahili. So, Swahili language, Luga ya Kiswahili. The very first word for today is Amua. 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 Now, what does Amua mean? Amua means decide. Well, let's see an example. If you want to say, I am deciding, in Swahili, you will say, Na Amua. Na Amua. Now, if you want to say, he or she is deciding, you will say, Ana Amua. Ana Amua. If you want to say, you are deciding, you will say, Una Amua. Una Amua. Una Amua. Okay, what about we are deciding? We are deciding will be Tuna Amua. Tuna Amua. Tuna Amua. What about they are deciding? They are deciding will be Wana Amua. Wana Amua. So you will see how easy Swahili is. I mean, you learn one word and after you have mastered the na, ana, una, tuna, wana, you can say many sentences using that. Okay, now we're going to see the next one, which is anda. 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 Anda means prepare. Now, let's see a few examples. Na anda. Na anda. Na anda. You can also say Nina anda. We have seen this. If you have not seen this yet, you can check out the pronouns. We have already covered it. Now, how about saying he or she is preparing? He or she is preparing will be Anna Anda. Anna Anda. Anna Anda. Now, what about you are preparing? That will be Una Anda. Una Anda. Una Anda. Now, for the last two, I will leave it for you to figure it out. One will be, we are preparing. The next one will be, they are preparing. Try to figure it out. How to say that? We are going to see the next one, which will be, Angalia. 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 Angalia means watch, watching. So if I say na angalia, that will be I am watching. Na angalia, na angalia, na angalia. What about she or he is watching? 
that will be ana angalia ana angalia ana angalia okay now what about they are watching they are watching will be wana angalia wana angalia wana angalia now here i will leave also two for you to figure them out one will be we are watching we are watching and another one will be you are watching all right now let's see the next one which will be anguka 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 means fall fall so to say they are falling that will be wana anguka wana anguka wana anguka how about we are falling we are falling will be tuna anguka tuna anguka as usual if you are, if i want to talk about myself that will be i am falling it will be na anguka na anguka oh nina anguka okay as usual i will leave you with two of them for you to figure to figure them out she is falling and you are falling try to see how you can use them okay now we're going to see another one which is acha 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 means quit okay so for example if i if i say nina acha or na acha means i'm quitting so if i say acha ujinga acha ujinga means quit being stupid stop being stupid okay now how about if i say she is quitting that will be ana acha ana acha now what about you are quitting that will be una acha una acha i will leave two of them for you to see which are we are quitting and they are quitting okay let's go to the next one this will be aldi 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 is land land for example if i want to say ministry of land that will be wizara ya aldi ministry is wizara land is aldi ya is off so ministry of land will be wizara ya aldi okay let's see the next one will be asali 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 is honey okay right after this we're going to see another one which is asilimia asilimia means percent percent so asilimia moja will be one percent asilimia mbili will be two percent now we have already seen numbers so i will just leave it for you to fill out how to say uh, 30 percent and 50 percent all right we're going to see the next one which is ow 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 means all 
if I want to say one or two. In Swahili language, I will say moja au mbili. Moja au mbili. Moja au mbili. Also, or can be ama. So, this one is the same. Moja ama mbili. Tatu ama ne. Okay, now we are going to see the last one, which will be azima. 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 Azima means borrow. Borrow. All right, now borrow clothes. This will be azima nguo. Azima nguo. Azima nguo. Azima is borrow. Nguo is clothes. Okay, so I hope you have learned something today. And if you uh, had any problem, don't hesitate to leave a comment, talk to us, and we will reply to you as soon as possible. Thank you. Bye-bye.